Hi children, welcome back to online session. Already I have completed with the unit 1 and 2. Mm, then unit 3, you are going to get the videos. Before that, I want to say to children, in the birds I lesson, I have completed it. Right children, you are going to get the video also. In that, I am going to read the lesson. I have explained it, but I want to say somewhere, a word has been, instead of saying, Yudhishthir, I said it as Uttarashtra. So I want to clarify only that one. Leftover is fine. Let me read the lesson itself. Just keep the finger on that line and you can do it. Long ago, when the Pandavas and Kauravas were young boys, they learned archery from Guru Dronacharya. One day, the Acharya arranged a shooting demonstration as a test of his disciples. Skills, parents and visitors all gathered to see how the princes were learning the skill. I wonder what the test will be. I hope it will begin soon. Just I am reading the lesson because I want to clarify only one doubt. That is the Yudhishthira. Right children? It's not a Dutharashtra. Well, listening. Sorry for that. It should be Yudhishthira. So I am reading the lesson. I will be completing it soon. Page number 42. Listen, princes. On the left branch of the of that tree, you can see a wooden bird. You have to stand on this line in front of you and shoot the eye of the bird with this bow and arrow. Are you ready? Yes, Guruji, we are ready. Good. Yudhishthira, you step forward first. It should be Yudhishthira, not Dhritarashtra. Dhritarashtra is the son of Kauravas, right? So, it should be good. Yudhishthira, you step forward first. Yudhishthira stood on the line, took up the bow and arrow and aimed. Yes, may I shoot? The Acharya scrutinized the position in which Yudhishthira was standing holding the bow. Yudhishthira, can you see me? Yes, teacher, I can see you clearly. Yudhishthira, put down the bow and go back. You can't hit the bird. Then it was Bhim Sen's turn. He came forward, lifted up the bow and took aim. Bhim, can you see the visitors on either side? Yes, sir, I can see them all, though not very clearly. Bhim, go back. You can't shoot the bird. Bhim Sen was puzzled, but he put down his bow and arrow and returned to, the, to his place. Next, Duryodhana came forward and took up the bow. He aimed at the bird and then turned towards the Acharya. Acharya, may I shoot? Don't. It will be waste of time. Go back to your place. One by one, all the princes came forward and prepared to shoot. The Acharya would ask them a question, listen to the answer and send them back. Everyone was surprised. The Acharya is very strict. He is not satisfied with anyone. Will even a single student be able to please him? At last it was Arjuna's turn to aim. He came forward, stood at the line and fixed the arrow to the bow. Arjuna, are you ready to shoot? Do you see me? Yes, sir. I am ready also. Do you see me? No, sir. Do you see the tree and the branches on which the bird is placed? No, sir. Do you see the bird? No, sir. Arjuna, what do you see? I see the eye of the bird which has to be shot. Good, Arjuna, shoot. Arjuna pulled the string of the bow taut until it touched his ear and shot. The arrow flew forward in a straight line without wavering and hit the eye of the bird. So, instead of wherever I said like Yudhishthira, we have to say, Please do it as Yudhishthira while listening the story. To say that one only once again I called because of some video in textbook. So I, I got in that way. So to do that corrections, this video is going to be sent you. It should be Yudhishthira. Okay. Thank you children. Have a great day.